right. You who are born again are of the spiritual Israel of God. You are not just a child of God. You're to be a soldier of God. You're to be a fighter in God. You cannot just let the enemy do what he wants in your life, in your family, in your house, in your walk. You can't let him have his way. You can't just accept it. You can't give in to it. You can't just agree with it or just say, okay, I can't do anything. You've got to resist it. You've got to take a stand against it. You've got to say no. If you don't fight, you lose. You are called to fight. And therefore we are told, you are told, finally, brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the full armor of God so that you'll be able to stand firm against the schemes of the devil. For our struggle is not against flesh and blood, against rulers, against powers. It's against world forces of this darkness, against spiritual forces of evil in the heavenly places. Therefore, take up the full armor of God. So you'll be able to stand and resist in that day of evil. And having done everything, stand firm. Stand firm, therefore. Having girded your belt, your waist with a belt of truth, having put on the breastplate of righteousness, and having strapped on your feet the preparation of the gospel of peace, in addition to all, take up the shield of faith by which you will extinguish the flaming arrows of the evil one, and take up the helmet of salvation and the sword of the Spirit, which is the word of God, having done all, stand. If you don't fight, you lose. If you do fight in this fight, you are guaranteed to win. Fight the good fight, fight the good fight, fight the fight of faith against fear, fight the fight of hope against gloom in your life, fight the fight of repentance against sin and, and against temptation, fight the fight of love against hate, fight for your calling, fight for your life, fight for your mantle, fight for what God has purposed for your life, fight to become that person. Do not fear, do not give in, do not be discouraged, you are on the winning side in the culture and in your life. Stand up to the darkness, stand up to the bully, stand up to the bully in the power of God and you will overcome. Because just as much as all this that's taking place in the world shows you how real your faith is, just as real it says you are actually more than a conqueror. You can actually do all things through Messiah who strengthens you and greater actually is he in you than he who is in this world. Amen. And amen.